Hello everyone at Bolingbrook Primary School. It's lovely to see you. Um, you probably don't know who I am, but I have worked with your school before. My name is Liz Neal and I work for a company called Usborne Books. And last year you did a sponsored read um, working with me where you raised so much money. You raised over a thousand pounds and your school were able to get into the, into, back into your school, 1,600 pounds in books, which was just incredible. So well done to all of you for that last year. Now, I'm back this year to work with you um, to do a virtual book fair. Now, normally a book fair, I would come into your school and I'd set up all my books all around your hall where you could come in with your parents or your carers and you can look at the books and choose them and have a little feel of them and see which one you like. Unfortunately, this year, because of all the bugs and germs that are around, I can't do that. However, we can still have a book fair, which is great news. And so, I'm going to bring you a virtual book fair. Now this will run on my Facebook page um, and a link will be sent to your school and your head teacher and your teachers will send that out to your parents um, on email or through your website and um, to your parents so that they can join the event and see lots and lots of books that will be posted on that event throughout the week. Now your book fair is taking place in the week where it is World Book Day. World Book Day is just a fantastic day where we can celebrate our love of books and our love of reading. Um, so I'm really excited that we're spending our World Book Day together. Um, so your book fair will start on Monday the 1st of March and it will run all of that week. World Book Day is on Thursday the 4th of March. And in the event, I will post lots and lots of different books. Here's some behind me that you can see. And some of these will be in your book fair and you'll have a chance to buy them. So what, we, what I'll do is post lots of books, as I say, and your parents are then able to make a comment if they would like to buy one for you, you've been really good. Um, if they'd like to buy a book for you, they just need to comment on the event and I'll get that ordered for you and it'll get sent to school for your teachers then to distribute them to you. So what type of books will be in the book fair? Well, this one has only just come out. It came out, I got it yesterday. It's only just been published. It's called The Shark Caller. And the blurb on the back says, I want to be able to call the sharks. Teach me the magic and show me the ways. Doesn't that sound exciting? So that's a brand new book that will feature in our book fair. Um, these books are always really popular, particularly with your five, six, year five, six. A hundred things to know about. This one is obviously about saving the planet, but there's lots of different titles in this range. So we've got science and history, um, planet Earth, um, numbers and coding, um, and I can't remember the others, but there's lots, there's about 10 of them, 10 different ones. And in this book, each page has a different fact and lots of information. This one says, scientists recruit animals to gather planet saving data. And there's lots of lovely pictures as well to help explain things. And you can just pick this book up and read one page at a time. You don't need to read the whole book. It's all factual, so it's a non-fiction book. There's lots of those and they'll be in the book fair as well. Um, what else have we got? This one is a lovely one. Very apt for the moment. What are germs? And this is one of our lift the flap books. So you can see in this we've got lots of information and there's flaps where you can find out more information underneath. So it asks questions and then it answers the questions underneath. We've got lots of this range as well, uh, but this is what are germs? The lift the flap books go right up to this size which is about space and again there's lots and lots of different types of books in that range. So at your book fair during that week I will post all different books but I'll also be posting some competitions where you can win some books. So you need to come on the, on the event to look for the competitions and make sure you enter so that you will be able to win a prize. I'll also be putting some sale items on so some of the books will be at a reduced price um, so it's really worth getting onto that site and having a look and seeing what books are available for you to buy. Um, I will see you live in the event. Um, you'll be able to watch it back if you don't see me live um, from Monday the 1st of March. I'm really excited, as I say, that it's World Book Day. So we'll be able to spend that time together um, and share our joy of reading. I hope that you love reading. I certainly love reading. It's a fantastic thing to do. Have a little thing. Where is your favourite place to read? Hmm. My favourite place to read is on a beach. And wouldn't that be lovely now to be able to go and lie on a beach with your book and just lie there and read? I also quite like reading in bed as well. 
at the moment we can do that we can do lots of that can't we can read in bed can't read at the beach so much at the moment um, but have a think about where your favorite place to read is and maybe you could share that with your families your grown-ups at home um, or your friends as well maybe when you're on a zoom meeting or you chat to them on text or whatever you chat to them on have a little think and share that with them okay so i look forward to seeing you on the first of march where we will be looking at lots and lots of different books um, so take care and I'll speak to you on the 1st of March. Bye-bye.